the essential part of Aston Martin you've seen this weekend is all about like-minded people loving these wonderful cars because I think, you know, as we know, it has to be one of the most beautiful shapes in the world for any car that's out there. And I think what it does is inspires people. It brings out a different, almost a child in people. Alton Park is a fantastic circuit. It's a traditional British circuit. It really is a, for motorbikes more than motor cars, to be honest. It's very twisty, it's very narrow. Um, it's a real technical circuit and a real challenge, but I love it. Uh, I think everybody loves driving here because it is such a challenge. The, the circuit is very demanding, particularly in the wet. Um, but it, it's a circuit that requires a lot of concentration and in a 100-minute you know, race it's very easy to make mistakes. The problem is that if you have an accident at Alton, it's never going to be a small one because it's so narrow, you're always going to be bang into something pretty quick. Yeah, the, the learning curve has been quite big today for the drivers, but I think everybody has taken something away that they'll certainly remember for future races. difficult because obviously there's a lot of spray coming up there and when there are other cars around it means that picking a point on the circuit where to turn it just gets harder and harder. We're lucky, I mean you can imagine in a Formula 1 car there are no windscreen wipers, just the visor and that's all you've got. So I'd like to, you know, to congratulate Mike Brown and, uh, and Paul Cripps for their first ever win today, you know it's great. I personally have worked with those guys quite close over the years and it's great to see them you know, finally get their first win. We're quite a close community in the GT3, in the Aston GT4 race series, so we know each other quite well. Um, we talk a lot and um, we have a shared nervousness about racing. You know, the essence of the GT4 Challenge is to give like-minded people the opportunity to race these cars and to share the experience together. And I think one of the big things we try to do with this challenge is get lots of like-minded people together and enjoy their, each other's company, whether it's on the racetrack or having lunch. You know, it's all about having fun together. And I think uh, today has been, been just another pure example of that. We, as, as a, a team, have a lot of customers that we corporately entertain at each race. So um, it's very important for us that we have the, the right setup. And secondly, you know, that the, the hospitality that's given reflects Aston Martin at the end of the day. This is a high-end product, so people expect high-end hospitality. The feedback generally has been really positive because these cars, you know, everybody loves driving the GT4 car. It's, it's a great, great experience for everybody. For me personally, it's such a you know a proud moment for me to look after and work with the team here to deliver these race meetings because these cars really infuse passion daily. There are lots of other one make series, but I don't think anything quite has the kudos that Aston Martin has. So it's it's competitive, but I just think it, the name and the brand carry that above the others, to be honest with you. So we're all very proud to wear the badge.